Hi, welcome back to the Top Talent um, <coughs> 10 10 podcast episode 2. Uh, coming up next is our sixth guest, Mr. Terry Finch. Terry, how are you? Could you tell us a quick little bit about yourself there, dude? And yeah, I've got a song to ask you about after you give us an intro. Um, oh, I'm fine, thank you. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, I've been a professional musician for maybe 30 years, something like that. I've worked on a cruise ships and holiday camps and all the all the other kind of stuff and all that. But I've I've gone back to writing my own stuff recently. Um, and that's kind of where I am, really. Well, I know that um, you you know you're doing multi genres and lots of different things. But this song, I f I forced you to play this song because it's so good. I love it. Called Find Me. Could you? A lot of people this will resonate to them. What's your reasons for writing Find Me? If you don't mind me being so personal, what's um, the story I, behind that? Uh, <laughs> I I uh, I'm a sperm donor to a gay couple, and uh, they've got a daughter, and I've never met her. So that, that's kind of. Hey. <laughs> that's, that's thanks, not... thanks for being so honest, dude. And I'm sorry for asking you a personal else, question. I don't know how else um, to put it, really. You know? uh, that's the truth. The, the song is wonderful, ladies and gentlemen. Let's 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 meet Mr. Terry Finch if you don't already know who he is. Um, one, two, three. Find me by Terry Finch. Somewhere where the wind blows shelter 
come and find me Please come and find me No matter where you are You can come and find me Please come and find me No matter where you are You can come and find me Magnificent, magnificent song, man. It's a, it's a world hit, in my opinion. Yeah. It is. It's absolutely fantastic. Um, that's all I've got to say on that. It's one of the best songs I've heard in a long time. Alaya, um, then Samuel. Alaya, what's your thoughts on Mr. Terry Finch and that wonderful song? I mean, it's sad. <laughs> it's uh, it made me sad, and I I, I like it. Uh, for well, for that, you know, I like sad songs and I like when songs help you uh, relate, even if you might have a total different situation. Um, I made a lot of sad songs. Thank you for sharing that. So honestly. Well said. Well said. Samuel, then Jesse. Uh, great song. Uh, great melody. Um, it puts you somewhere um it has really emotional kind of feeling in it and i really love this song so let me say this uh, before i leave i have to leave actually uh, because i've got another interview mm -hmm. um i am happy that i am introduced to such people such great talent from different uh, parts of the world and i am grateful to meet all of you uh, including the host yourself I am happy and uh, nice meeting you all. Great music. So I really love this song. Pleasure, Samuel. Thanks for coming. And until the next time, we'll see you later, brother. Okay. We'll yes, see you the next yes. time. Yes. Sure. Sure. Well, see you. well said, Samuel. Thanks for, the, thanks for hanging around so long. Jesse, then, Je Jesse, then Tim. Jesse, what's your thoughts? It was a great song. And I've really liked your vocals. And I love the harmony you add, added into it. Being a country musician, I love all of the harmonies <laughs> all the time. Um, and then hearing the backstory made it really awesome to listen to after knowing how it was inspired. So great job. Thank you. <laughs> well said, well said. Tim, then Joe Cole, Kirsty, then Sasha, our next artist. Yes, I uh, I thought the song was great, uh, very genuine from the heart song. Um, I could just feel the emotion behind it, and I just I thought it was great. Your vocals were great for it. Um, I don't know what your who your influences are. I hear a little bit of uh, John Lennon in that feel. I hear a little bit of Americana, uh, just a little bit of everything, but all together, man, I thought it was, it was just, it was just awesome. Like I said, another one that touched my heart. Thank you. Thank you. Well said, well said, well said. Joe Cole, Kirsty, then our next guest, Sasha. And, and by the way, Craig, if you want to say anything, just unmute yourself, Craig Darrick is... He likes to he likes to sit and study folk, and I'm not. I, I, they asked me today. Don't make me talk every time. But if you want to say anything, Derek, you just unmute yourself there, brother. You can butt in every time. So, Drew. I did. Yes. Uh, that is a very emotional track. You know, I love the guitar. I love everything. The voice. Everything is amazing. It's very touching. I love it. Thank you. Well <laughs> said. Well said. Well said. Kirsty, then the lovely Sasha is now. Hey, Terry. Um. That song is so catchy. I could I could start singing the words as soon as I heard it the first time. Um, and yeah, it's a beautiful song. It's, it's 
beautiful and knowing the, the history the reason why you wrote it it's made it even more special so yeah it's awesome thank you no problems <laughs> Absolutely fa fantastic. Sasha, what's your comment? And then I'm going to ask you about yourself next. Um, so, yeah, again, you've left me near the end. So everything has more or less been said. But I love the concept of the song. I think that's brilliant because um, it's so unique as well like and rare for a song like that to be about like a hot topic like that. Um, and I love the production and the vocals great as well. I think you sound brilliant. Thank you. Well said, well said, well said. So.